Hey guys, Private Crow here, and I'm going to show you how to get a picture off the internet and put it on your GTA 5 online crew emblem. You can put on your shirt, car, whatever, like, that's allowable. All you uh, need is Notepad++ here and a picture, 512 by 512. So all you want to do is go to the internet, search a picture of something. Uh, I had to enter it, enter the, the numbers, 512, 512 right here. Guys, you should be able to go here and like enter it yourself, but I don't see where it won't let me. So I just had to enter it, and I'm just looking ca Dodge cars because I, I kind of like Dodge cars actually. Pretty cool. So uh, I picked one, and I just so I picked the police car right here. So all you do is click it, save it, save it to your desktop. I recommend so you don't lose it or anything, so you know where it's exa ex exactly at. And then what you want to do, once you save it, you want to go to the internet and type in Vector Magic. Should be the first one or something. And then it should come up as this, this screen right here. What you want to do is upload image right here. Click this. It should be at the desktop. So wherever you saved it. Uh, mine was, uh, let's see, I'm just going to... You want to open it? All right, here it is. So now what you want to do is, um, as it classifies and traces it, it, it's tracing right now. So that'll trace it. Should come come up as um, two images. There you go. And then you could come down here and do some custom editings, different stuff to it. All this stuff, remove background and <clears throat> stuff like that. And then you want to come down here and uh, see the thing is, yeah, so it should be, yeah, of course. And then, um, okay, it's traced and everything. So now you want to download this and then click Enable Download. But what you want to do before all this, um, if you're this far in and don't and lost, then um, what you got to do is you got to download this first. Um, wait, well. No, you don't have to download. All you gotta do is enter your email. You have to download Notepad Plus Plus. So you wanna you wanna click this SVG. Click that. Save. Okay, as you see, it's saved. And then, oh. Well, And then you want to open it. We'll see if I can find it here. <laughs> I'll look for here. All you should have to do is just click it. Yeah. And open it with Notepad. Plus plus. All right. Let's see. Edit the notepad plus plus. You get all the stuff that shows up here. So all you want to do is just uh, see. So. 
You don't need this. Why does it look like this for me? Hold on, guys. It, it, I don't think it even should look like that. Uh, let's see. Here we go. There you go. Add a limit pad plus plus. There we go. This is more like it. Okay, let's see. Uh, you don't need any of this stuff. So right here, number four. Just copy all of this. And then you want to leave out the... Uh, that this little SVG thing down at the bottom, you want to leave that out. Copy this. Okay, we have all that. And then what you want to do is you want to go to the internet. And you want to go here. Open up your Rockstar. As soon as it loads here. Sorry about that. Okay, you want to go to your to your crew. <clears throat> oh, sorry about this, guys. I gotta sign in here. As you see, mine is the Under Armour one because I made an Under Armour one. 512, 512. Uh, now, let me go up here, edit. You want to turn. You want to turn off the background. And then what you want to do is you want to right click right here. Inspect element. Now, um, yeah, you want to search your SVG, your SVG that you saved. I hate when this stuff pops up. Um, this crap always pops up. This is not even the stuff either. If you're having the same issue, just watch what I do and um, it should help you out. But it's really annoying. I, I'm having troubles with it already, as you can tell. doing this to me. <laughs> Stop it. No. Oh, here it is. Okay, here it is. You want to uh, click this. You want to edit as HTML. Okay, right here. Here it is. Right in between this right here, you want to click it, and you want to paste from what you copied in the uh, one thing, and then just click, um, and then just click off of it, and then there you go. You just close out of this, Your image is right there, and then all you gotta do is just um, just save it. Well, it, it, it's not saving right now, but um, after it saves, it should come down up here. And then all you have to do is just right-click, right-click on one of the emblems, and then it should say, 
uh, status clan, uh, crew emblem. Just click that. And then it might take five minutes longer than that. I don't know. It might take a while. But just just wait and patient. And then you can add it to your car and stuff. And that is uh, pretty much how you do that. Thank you guys. And...